Oh my gosh, Sandy, can't you believe we won a, an award last episode? I know, it was so sick. And guess what? What? Next episode, I'm going to turn 17. You're going to be older than me. I know. Hey, Daddy. Oh, hey, Thomas Jr. What's that? This is an Oscar because me and your mother want a movie. Well, you wait, you guys pay money just to win a movie? No, we win an Oscar. What's that? It's like a trophy for the best movie of 2022. Oh, yeah. Did you see that when, when, when Will Smith sl slapped Chris Rock or Chris Brown or something? Yeah, that was epic. And I'm so glad we did a reference to it. I know, right? Anyways, um, this is what your mom and dad gave me while you guys were away on episode 27. They gave me some drip. And I'm not talking about what drips come from the sky. I'm talking about like this drip. Thomas, huh? I don't feel safe. Hang on. What were you saying? Oh, I was saying that. Hang on. Oh, with Thomas Jr., by the way, uh, we got you a Game & Watch. It was the last one in stock. Gee, thanks, Dad. I had two enough of those already. Now I, uh, I have one. Now I have two. And, ah, and a Lightning McQueen pinball machine. You can play with that later. Not right now. Okay, I see. Uh, Anyways, thanks for the gift, Thomas. Hey, don't call me that. Call me Daddy. Yeah, call me Mommy. Shut up, Sandy. I can call you whatever I want. Thomas Jr., that is not how you talk to a woman like that. Do you understand? Yes, Dad. Anyways, I don't feel safe with Thomas Jr. running around with all that money. Yeah. You know, I just heard what you just said. Yeah, and we don't feel safe with that. You might get robbed. What's that? Do you, am I Mr. Beast and I give stuff? No, they take... Robbing means they take stuff from you. Like, like stealing. Oh, so you want to steal a girl. Don't worry, Thomas. There's a lot of steps you have to do with that. Don't call me Thomas, Thomas Jr. But that's my name, Thomas. Junior. Okay? All right, fine, whatever, Dad. Okay. Anyways, uh, so me and Sandy. Wait, Thomas, I think I, I got something that Justin probably doesn't use anymore. Maybe he can let Thomas Jr. have it. Okay, go ask him. Don't worry, Thomas Jr., I'll be back. Oh, man, this long day of work is stressful. Okay. Time to get this out. Hey, Justin. Uh, what do you want, Sandy? Can't you see? You're, you're not ready till the next scene. And why are you filming me? Why is Bowser filming me? Don't break the fourth wall, Tom. D Justin. Okay, sorry. Anyways, what do you want from me? Well, you see that old wa that wallet over there? Yeah. Do you use it? What kind of question is that? No, I put money in a pocket like a real man. We don't need wallets. We don't need that. Okay, so can I keep it? Yeah, sure, I don't care. Oh, gee, thanks, Justin. That's the only thing you're going to give me, right? Yeah, that's it. That also marks as your birthday gift. Oh, yeah. Uh, and by the way, happy birthday. Happy birthday to you, too. But my birthday's not until October. Okay, this scene is dragging on right now. It's like a minute long now. Yeah, I think you should leave. Yeah, I'm going to leave. Bye. Bye. Anyways, back to this work. Huh. I kind of feel like changing my channel logo. Don't change it! I thought you were leaving! Well, when you said I should change the channel logo, I said don't. Okay, get. can you like get out? All right, fine, jeez. All right, Thomas, I'm back. All right, Thomas, Jr., me and your mother got a surprise for you. What? 
We got you a wallet. What's that? It's a thing where you put your 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 money and coins in. Oh, how does it work? It's simple, son. All you gotta do. Oh, gosh. Uh. Is to open it up, okay? Do you have like a coin? Oh, I got a, I got a, a nickel right up my butthole. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> Here you go, Daddy. You, you, I, I, I'm pretty sure it has hypnotitis or something. Anyways, uh, put in there. And there, zip, put the zipper up, close it nice and tight, and there, it's safe and sound. That motherfucker, Thomas Jr., what's wrong? That, li that little money bastard just stole my nickel. Oh, don't worry, Thomas Jr., you can always get it back. No, this thing robbed me. Dad, call the police. No, no I, 911 is for real emergencies. Junior, it's eight o'clock at night. I'm not gonna call the police. And also, it's during spring break. Why would I do it? Listen here, buddy. Listen to me. Ow! You're gonna get my money back, okay? You're gonna get me my five cents back. Got that? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Thomas Junior, Thomas Junior, look. All you gotta do is to go in the wallet and then pull the nickel out. Simple as that. Oh. So go in your room and put the money in. Okay, Daddy. See you later. Take this. Bye, Thomas Jr. Why does everything have to be so difficult with him? I have no idea. All right, Dad. I put the money in the wallet. Good. Now, it's past your bedtime. It is 8.57. You gotta go to bed. Your bedtime at 8.50. Ah, oh, okay. Good night, son. Anyways, ding dong! Oh, who could be at the door? Hang on, let me get it. So here's my number. That ass will call me, maybe. Uh, uh. Hi, Super Y. What are you doing here at my house? Hey, on, and why is the flashlight on? Oh, well. Anyways, what are you doing here? Weren't you supposed to be in last episode? Thomas, I was in last episode. Anyways, I went in your mailbox. Why did you go in my mailbox? Well, I'm the CEO of Wakini Enterprises, and uh, I just wanted to know that here's your bill. Um, okay. There's a surprise in it, too. Okay. And it's like a massive, huge, huge surprise. And I want to witness it with you, too. So, can I come in? Uh, yeah, sure. You can come in. Come on. Aha, sweet. <sighs> oh, my gosh. Sandy. Yeah? We're past due in gazillion amount of bills. This is ridiculous. Darn right. Oh my gosh, it is ridiculous. You've been passing your, you've been overdoing your bills for the past three months. What are you spending your money on? Gifts from my girlfriend. And guess what? If you don't pay it, all your bills midnight tonight, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take your house. Take this bed and take your girlfriend. Uh, you'll never go with him, right? You know I'll never do it. Oh, yeah? Well, I got bank accounts. And I mean bank accounts of 10K cash. It's like infinity and beyond. If you spend something, boop, cash will be right back. It's like infinite. Ooh. Dang right, ooh. Anyways, have fun. 
being lo lonely and I'll also take your son too, Thomas. I'll be called Papa Wyatt. So Papa Super Y. Anyways, I'll go take this. Anyways, bye. Bye. Henry! Oh my gosh, Thomas, what? I was in the other room. You could have just asked me to come here. Look, we're past doing our bills. What? Oh my, wait, hang on. Oh my gosh, $25 in debt? No, it's actually 30. Oh my gosh. Thomas, you can't afford that. Yeah, why are you leaving me to pay all the bills? Because you're the main character of the show, duh. And also because I'm tired of paying the bills, so I want you to pay the bills. What? But I'm 16 years old. A 16-year-old doesn't have to pay bills. Well, you can, you pay your phone bill, right? Yeah. Then that it's the same as paying the water, gas, electricity, and etc. Oh my gosh, this is a lot of money. Sandy, how are we supposed to get this money by midnight tonight? I don't know. Well, you guys better figure it out. Wait, is that an Oscar award? Yeah, we won it last episode. Ha ha ha, lucky man. Anyways, I'll go take this. Don't take it, Henry. Okay, fine. I just wish I had one. Yeah, we all wish we had one. Anyways, bye. Bye. Anyways, Thomas, how are you going to pay all these bills by midnight tonight? Gee, I don't know. Who has $30? Wait. Uh, wait a minute. I know. Gordon. I've held him all those times. Yeah, maybe he can do you a favor. Thanks, Sandy. You're the best. Anyways, you count all these bills for me. And anyways, I'm going to go now. Bye. Hey, I just met you. Dana. So... Yeah. God damn, what's the lyrics? Uh, hey, I just met you, then I so, uh, this is crazy, then I so here's my number, then I so call me maybe. Hey, Gordon, what are you doing? I'm listening to Call Me Maybe. Duh. What do you think I'm doing? Anyways, um, I'm in, uh, I was wondering if I can borrow some money. Hang on. Wait, what are you doing? Hmm. Uh, come on, where is it? What are you doing? Isn't it obvious? What, you used a paper magnifying glass just to make that joke? Yeah, duh, isn't it obvious? I don't have any money. I'm $50 in debt. What, what were you spending your money on? On Rebecca, I bought her a Gucci purse. You bought her, you bought Sandy a Gucci purse. Oh my gosh, that explains why I'm in serious debt. Wait, you're in debt too? Huh, debt bros. Nah. Huh, okay. But still, can I at least borrow $30? Did I, do you want me just to make that joke again? No. Uh, then that's your answer. You gotta find it somewhere else. Look, here's a tip. I usually steal things from Rebecca all the time. So all you gotta do is to steal from Thomas Jr. But, but stealing is wrong. Or you can ask him. But a little just embarrassing. Come on, Thomas. You're 16 years old. We don't have to go through this. All you gotta do is to put your mind up to it. Really? You really think so? Yeah. Okay, thanks, Gordon. Hey, don't pat me on the head. Anyways, I'll see you later. Bye. Bye. Anyways, hey, I just met you. So it's been crazy. So here's my number. So call me, maybe. Oh my gosh, these bills, these prices are insane. Insane. I know, right? Anyways, I'll see you later, Sandy. See you later. Sandy, 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 I got the good idea. What, you're gonna get the money? Uh, you got the money? I am gonna get it. I just know how. How? Stealing. Thomas, don't steal. What's wrong? Don't worry, Sandy. Everything's going to be under control. Trust me, okay? All right, fine. Have fun getting ran over by a steamroller. You're not supposed to spoil it. Sorry, my mistake. 
Anyways, time to go to Thomas Jr. Why is he sleeping on his chair? The three dollars. Yeah. Ew. Come on. I want to take the money. Yes, I got the money. All right, Sandy. I got the money. You did? Yeah. And it's perfect. It is perfect. A sweet 30 smackaroons. Mmm, 30 smackaroons. Okay, that's good to hear. Did you wake up? No, 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 no. Not a peep. Oh, wait, it's midnight. All right, Sandy, time to give this money to Super Y. Okay. Oh, man, I love singing Schoolhouse Rock songs. Hey, oh, you got the money? Uh, I sure do. Here you go. Ow. Well, anyways, I was about to shove this in your face. Oh, evicted and single forever. Well, that was me who kind of made me not want to give you the $30. Okay, okay, okay. I'm sorry. I won't say that anymore. All right, it. Okay, good. Now, bye. All right, I hope we don't have this problem next month. He's, we're going to have a problem next month. Huh. All right, Thomas, did you get... Did you give him the money? Yep. No, we don't talk about it anymore. Daddy! What do you want, Thomas Jr.? You should be in bed already. Somebody stole 30 smackaroons from my wallet. Thomas Jr., I think you miscounted. No, 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 no. Hear me out, Dad. I counted 47 times to see if I was I was on on. On, on this Oscar reward or something because there's like little smarty powder dust. I think I'm, I, I was trying to check to see if I was on Reese's Pieces right now. And, and it turns out, my, my surprise, I wasn't. I would check if I was hallucinating. I asked Prince if I was hallucinating, but he said, no, Thomas Jr., you're not hallucinating. Maybe somebody stole 30 smackaroons from my wallet. Did you do it, Mommy? What? No, I was here the entire time. Did you do it, Daddy? Oh, uh, no, no, no. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, hang on, Thomas Jr. Let me go see. Let me see if I'm lying. Here, there's like a lot of proof in there. Oh, uh, okay. Somebody called the cops? Wait, James, you're the cops? Of course I am, dummy. Hang on, James. I, I think I'm the cop. What? Blackman Thomas? Yeah, it's me, dummy. Oh, hey, look. It's Thomas Jr. Look, we're like, I'm like half the size as him. Yeah, I think nobody cares. Nobody cares about your mom because she's a pig. Oink, 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 oink. Don't make me slap you again. Okay, fine. Anyways, what do you need? Somebody stole 30 smackaroons from my wallet. $30? Oh my gosh, that is... Oh my gosh. Well, do you have any evidence? The only evidence I found was this. The only evidence... This is the only evidence I have. It's like... It's like a tea. Oh my gosh. And... I know my name's Thomas Jr., but it can't be that because I was sleeping the entire time. Dad, you checked up on me last night, right? Uh, yeah. Hmm, okay, this is even more suspicious. And look, and it smelled like boiled cheese. Hang on. It smelled like something, something big. Uh, okay. Anyways, wait a minute. I know what it stands for. Thief money? Oh, yeah, it could be that. No, 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 that's too stupid. Um, thief? Yeah, it could be that. No, that's too stupid, too. Ooh, 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 I know. 
Uh, what? How about Feth money? Yeah, that one's good. Yeah, yeah, I'll stick with that. Yeah, Feth money. Okay, anyways, I'm going to report this on the news. And, uh, yeah, so bye. Okay. All right, guys. Uh, let's go watch the news. Wait, Thomas, wait, Thomas Jr., I have a question for you. Yeah, I have a question for you. What would you do if someone stole $30 from you? Oh, that's an easiest question. I want, I want them to die in a fire. Oh, 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 wow. And, and eat their brains. And, and their eyeballs. And their legs. And every single body part. Okay, uh, how about this? How about I put this on the news? Yeah, that's what we just said. Okay, hear, hear me out, son. We'll put it on the news. And then uh, we'll see what the people want. Just because, well, you know, okay? Okay, Bachman Thomas. All right, good. Now I'll, no, I'll, I'll like, leave you. Okay. All right, James, let's go. Okay. <laughs> do, 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 do. Breaking news, okay? Mm. Mm, mm, mm. This is good food. Get out of here, Charlie. I'm the new news reporter now. Oh, man. Anyway. <laughs> stupid camera. Uh, anyways. Uh, mm. This is really good food. Anyways, breaking news, okay? Oh. Somebody stole 50, well, $30 from a child named Thomas Jr. And uh, we spoke with the town. And let's see what, what punishment we should give to the thief. All right, everybody. Here it is. We're doing this from smallest to greatest. So 1%. Was which was eating his body parts. I already know who that was. Well, yeah, James told me so. 65% run over by steamroller? Oh, wow. Well, they're going to break easily, so I don't know what's the point. 74% um, said go uh, die in lava. And 100%, oh, gosh. Burn in the corpse of the earth, which is hell. Like, oh my gosh, that. Can we just, like, like do and do put a song and then everybody will feel better or something like how and Gumball does it? But, oh my gosh, uh, okay, that's a little dark, don't you think? I just want to let you all know that, um, I'm studying for my exam. Okay, let's... Seven thousand dollars times forty-two. Oh, that is a huge number. Anyways, hey, Justin's mom, what are you doing? Uh, you want me to help you study for your exam? No, you know, uh, yeah, because it's gonna be too hard anyway. Yeah, but I don't, I'm only thirteen anyway, so yeah, I'm just, I'm just thirteen. Uh, anyways, uh, have fun eating that salad. Anyways, wow, that, the, the last one was pretty dark, don't you think? Um, anyways, on to the weather. Oh, and by the way, Justin's mom, you're, you're not allowed to, like, study and eat in a news station because it'll make it look like the Office TV show, but on a news channel, so... Uh, I'll just let you off the hook for this one, okay? Okay, capiche? Capiche, okay. Uh, anyways, on to the weather. Like, seriously. Oh my gosh! Anyways, Dad, I'm gonna go now. Bye. Oh no, Sandy! Look! What? Look what's gonna happen to me! Oh, uh, Thomas? 
I think I'm gonna run some errands. I'll be back in a few weeks. But Sandy, don't you see what they're gonna do to me? They're gonna burn me in the corpse up there. Like the core of it. I know, but don't worry. I'll be back sooner than you think. You better be quick. Anyways, Thomas, uh, I went to the bank and, uh, or build an ATM and we just, I got you 30 bucks. Oh, gee, thanks, Sandy. Uh, this means a lot to me. I know. Now go and return it to Thomas Jr. before it gets worse. Wait, hang on. Before I do, uh, let me go ask him something. Uh, okay. <laughs> hey, Thomas Jr. Oh, hey, Dad. <laughs> What what you doing? Uh, nothing much. I'm just playing some some. So you're uh you're playing that night fork game again? Yeah, it's really popular now. I'm trying to get that amazing six Spider-Man skin. Ah, ah, ah. Oh okay. Well, did you know that they removed the towers? Those sick bastards! Screw you, Epic Games! Ah crap. Uh, oh, Thomas Jr., pause your game. Okay, fine. What do you want from me, Dad? Uh, I have a question for you. What? What would you do if someone stole $30 from you? Uh, $30? Well, that will be a lot of things, Dad. It, I'll cut their head off. I'll get their brains and eat it. Put it back. Front, vomit it in their head. Eat their eyeballs. And... Ah! Well, he said he was going to cut my brains off, eat it, vomit it back in, and then throw me in the pits of fire. Oh, gosh. Thomas, Thomas, you got to return his $30. Yeah, you're right. I think he's going to bed. Oh, man, I'm so scared. Okay, uh, I'll see you on the other side, Sandy. I'm not going to hell, you know. Okay, whatever, okay? Anyways, I need to return this to him before I die. Oh, there it is. Time to put the money in. Daddy, what are you doing? Hang on, let's tack here. Daddy, what are you doing? Uh, Thomas Jr., it isn't what, you're, what it looks like. Just tell me. Uh... All right, Thomas Jr., I gotta admit it. I was hiding it for almost a day now, and I was the one who stole dirty dollars from you. What? Uh, I, I just needed it to pay my bills because I was so far behind, and I didn't want to ask you because it was too embarrassing. Oh, Dad, it's not embarrassing. You should have just asked. I know. Well, I'm sorry for stealing. And I just paid you back. Uh, I, I hope you forgive me. Oh, I forgave you, Dad. Pshh. What, 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 what was that? Ah, 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 ah. Yes, there it is. The $30. This is what I need. Stop right there. What do you think you're doing? Ah, oh no. I better cut. I better take this money. Oh, yeah? Yeah! Uh, let me go, please! Uh, thanks for turning him in, Thomas. You want to know how long he's been on a lookout for? How long? Like, 30 years. 30 years? That's a long time. And it was before I was born. It sure is, buddy. Wait! Don't leave me! I have a wife and kids! Wait, up! Wait, James! Yeah, uh, I forgot something that he has. What? Vomit it out. Blech. Blech. 
Uh, this is actually mine. Thank you very much. Anyways, take him away, James. You have to ask me twice. Come on, buddy. No, please don't leave me. I learned my lesson. I have a wife and kids. Well, have fun burning in the pits of hell, buddy. No! Remember, kids, don't steal.